Mark chapter nine verse four, and Elijah appeared to them with Moses, and they were talking with Jesus. During his transfiguration, Jesus was accompanied by Moses and Elijah, and they talked together. What do you think they talked about? And the Bible simply says、uh, they spoke to Jesus. It's a good chance. To use our imagination under the guidance of the Holy Spirit. Where had they come from? Heaven. How had they got there? Jesus had resurrected Moses and taken Elijah alive. Why had they been saved? What had saved them? It was only possible because of the coming suffering. And resurrection of Jesus Christ. So, what do you think they would have talked with Jesus about? We can imagine two possible subjects of discussion. One is sorrow. Perhaps they expressed how sorry they were for their sins, and their deep regret that Jesus had to go down the path of suffering on their behalf. Another option is gratitude. Perhaps they voiced to Jesus how thankful they were for His great sacrifice. Moses and Elijah, representing two groups of people, will be saved on the day of Jesus' second coming. Moses represents those who will go to heaven after being resurrected from their graves. Eliza represents those who will be translated to heaven without seeing death. If Jesus is your Lord, you will belong to one of these groups, either Moses or Elijah. What would you like to talk to Jesus about when he comes, surrounded by the glory of heaven? You would no doubt express both your sorrow and gratefulness. Have you accepted Jesus as your personal savior? Instead of waiting for the day of His second coming, why not express your sorrow and gratitude today, right now? Sorrow will lead you to repentance, and gratefulness will result a joyful life. Living with this kind of mindset will protect us from the deceitfulness of the world. It helps us to safeguard spiritual purity. I pray that we will all experience the honor of talking to Jesus on the day He returns.